Big things come in small packages. Shut up! We are checking back in with Jack and Susan, who just moved into their 16 square foot tiny dream house. We're so happy we downsized. Now we can finally afford my dream lakeside wedding. Yeah. People say that living in a tiny house could be a drag, but they're totally wrong. With all the money that we're saving, I can afford to get my fiance Susan romantic gifts all the time. Jack, is that a popcorn maker? <laughs> what? No way. Spoiler alert, it is a popcorn maker. <laughs> When Susan and I went to Disneyland two years ago, she just loved the popcorn. So I know she's gonna love this gift. It can make so much popcorn. There's so many uses for popcorn. You can eat it. You can make necklaces out of it. You can eat it. Well, this one barely has a kernel in it. How much did you spend on this? Oh, it was, a, it was a Groupon, so it was really cheap. It was, it, was like, it was a little over 500. With the wedding budget very tight, Susan looks for other ways to save money. I decided to start a compost pile because someone keeps spending the money that we're supposed to be saving. That way I won't have to pay for garbage pickup anymore. That'll save us $8 a month or $96 a year. I could make at least 25 bucks off this on eBay. I thought I looked a little plump in my wedding suit. So with all the money we saved, I... I bought some workout equipment. <coughs> a lot of people may say, hey Jack, Why'd you just spend $3,000 on a treadmill? That's wasting money. But what they don't understand is I got a great Groupon deal. I got this protein powder for free. All of it free. <laughs> Jack, you've got it all over my veil. Sorry, baby. Jack has already lost one pound on the treadmill this week. If he keeps that pace up, he'll be only 35 pounds by our two year anniversary. He's actually kind of inspired me to work out with him. Feel the burn! Yeah. Feel the burn! Things are going great for the bride and groom to be until Susan makes a troubling discovery. Jack? Yes, sweetheart? I just checked our bank account and all of our wedding money is gone. What? Have you been spending the money? No! I mean, I might have spent a little bit here or there. <laughs> that we can't afford my dream wedding on the way! Sweetheart! 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 Despite all our ups and downs, Jack really came through and gave me the wedding of my dreams. I now pronounce you man and wife. Yeah! What up? And now to consummate the marriage. Oh, oh yeah. Oh my god. Um, where do we, where do we put all these presents? I don't know, just wherever you can find free space. Okay, you're pinching me. Ow, 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 ow. Fire! Join us next time on Tiny House Hunters when Roger and Kim Clombottom move into a spacious microwave. Hey guys, thanks so much for subscribing. Click I, make sure you're subscribe. Make Jack, sure you subscribe Jack, to Jack, Smosh. I already said that, Jack. Click the video on the left to watch bloopers from this video and this. <laughs> wow. And, yeah. And click the video on the right to watch Smosh play Hot Tub Truth or Dare. Those boys are sexy. Like person to your right foot. Ah! And if you have one of the touchscreen devices, you could like a phone or a TV. If you have a Jack, touch we screen, get it. We get it. Click the link below. I I need a divorce. Do you want some popcorn while you wait? Yeah. Do you want butter or no butter? Butter. For sure. Okay. Uh it's a little cold. <laughs>